Hi friends, Dr. Komal here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I will be sharing about symptoms and cause of D. quillwins tenosynovitis. I have created mnemonics for this for easy remembrance. So here we go. D. quillwin tenosynovitis. It is defined as the inflammation of tendons on the side of the wrist and at the base of the thumb. These tendons include the extensor pollicis brevis and the abductor pollicis longus tendons. The mnemonic for remembering its symptom and the secret code is PS thumb wrist yes you read it right you heard it right it is very easy to remember so here we go where p stands for pain and swelling near base of thumb p again stands for pain and swelling around the wrist which causes difficulty in grasping and pinching or making fist S stands for squeaking sound. As the tendons move within the swollen sheath, this sound is produced. S stands for swelling and pain on the side of your wrist. So this was about the symptoms of D. quillwins tenosynovitis. Now coming to the cause of this disease. As we have seen that it is all revolving around the tendons, so easy, easiest way was to keep tendon as the mnemonic for cause. So, T stands for trauma, any injury to wrist or thumb. E stands for excessive or repetitive strain. N and here I have mentioned for the new mothers as it is commonly seen in new mothers due to lifting of the baby. As it is also called as baby wrist or mother's thumb. D stands for diseases like inflammatory arthritis, rheumatoid arthritis. It is commonly seen in those people too. O stands for overuse of wrist such as Intensive computer mouse use, prolonged piano playing, typing, knitting, sewing, carpentry, etc. Wherever the wrist is overused. N here stands for the cause which is not exactly known. But females above 40 years of age or during pregnancy are at higher risk of developing it. We have covered the causes too. Thanks for watching. Hope you have liked it. You have noted it. Hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more further medical lectures and videos that might help you. Thank you so much.